sassy sleuths evie bug here and welcome to another episode inside of nancy drew shadow at the water's edge where we last left off we had just gotten jump scared in the bathroom so there's that um okay so we need to let's see what do we need to do i guess we could go see miwako Let's see. Okay. Hi! Hello. I hear this place has a reputation as a destination for ghost hunters. We didn't ask for it. It's all that stupid book. Those people, they have no respect for anyone or anything. I saw a certificate certifying that the Ryokan was cleansed of all ghosts and spirits. Can you tell me about that? What? That's no offense, but that seems sort of silly. A certificate? So you don't know anything about it? No. And where exactly did you find this certificate? Behind the portrait I helped Rentaro repair. Maybe you should stay away from what isn't yours. And maybe he should have the sense to know what is a family matter. I have to get back to work now. Okay, well can Come we... back later. What? Come back later, that seems rude. That seems really rude. Well then, does Rentaro have anything to say? Hi! Hi! Do you know what happened to the mirror in the baths? Oh, that thing. I sort of hid it a few years back and put a little hairline crack in it. Its days have been numbered for a while. Sorry about breaking it. Oh no! Uh, don't worry. I'm just glad you didn't get hurt. Mirrors can be very dangerous when they're breaking. In more ways than one. What do you mean? Oh, oh shards of glass and such. Not something to fool around with. Hmm. Something weird happened. When I looked in the mirror, I didn't see my reflection. Aha! You know what happened? You're a vampire! Seriously, though, that's pretty messed up. Maybe you need to get a little rest. This place might be getting to you a little. I'll stop bugging you now. See you later. All right, see you later. Well, we could... I need a dictionary to translate that. Let's see. What's it say? Oh, train parking. Okay. Oh, okay, so we are going to go on this thing. Where are, we, where are we supposed to go, anyway? Do we have notes that say where Bess and George are? Let's see. Okay, let's see, so the Ryukan is at Mis Misawa. I'm gonna mess up all these names, so I apologize. So let's see, the Ryukan is at the Misawa station. Pachinko Parlor is at the Kure station. Uh, the Expo Center is at the Matsu Station, so we need to get to Matsu, let's see. There's Kure. I don't see it. La la la. Oh, there's Matsu, okay. So I guess we just start heading somewhere. Let's see, let's go to this one. Then down to here. Oh, but now what? Let's see. Do we want to get... Which one do we want to get on to? Mm -hmm. How do we get onto like that light blue one? This is confusing. How are we supposed to get anywhere? Oh, okay, here, we'll go down here, then up to this one, and then up here and down. Okie dokie. Got it. So let's go to Kochi next. Okay, I'm pretty sure I know where I'm going. <laughs> we'll, f we'll figure this out. Okay, hopefully we get there. We'll just keep clicking on things. Alright, then we should go to Fuji and then go straight down. Let's see, there's this one. And then which one's next? Oh, Matt's is next. So that should do it. Alright, let's go see Bus and George. Interesting. This? this looks important. I'd better hang on to it. Hmm, Chinese puzzle box. Okay. Oh, what's this? And this like Suki? <laughs> okay. 
I think the cat sounds are making my dogs go crazy. <laughs> Puppies, come here. <laughs> okay, who is this? Hi, is your name Yumi? Absolutely not. Who's asking? It might be. Are you going to order? What's your agenda here, strange? I'm Nancy Drew. Mm, nope, never heard of you, but thank you for saying your name out loud. Oh, wait, Nancy Drew? As in friends with Beth and George and staying at the Ryokin, Nancy Drew? Or are there two of you? Which one is it? That's me, the friends with Bess and George. Excellent. Yes, perfect. Get over here. Come on. You're learning to make bento the Yumi way. Come on, trust me, it's a life skill. Once you know how to make a good bento box, you pretty much got the whole world all figured out. Sure, okay, sounds I'm good. good. We'll try Fantastic. it. Fantastic. Here are the ingredients. You may notice that they run the gamut from pretty cute to insanely adorable. This is not an... Okay, very easy. The customers will give you a list of what they want and how they want it organized, and you pack it together. You won't believe how easy it is. Okay, I gotta go. Going? Where are you going? The store. Good luck. You'll do fine. I'll be back soon. Okay. <laughs> Wait. I guess I'd better get to work. All right, so we've got a pig egg here, bunny egg here, bunny sandwich here for sure. Now this one's got a bunny rabbit and then rice and a sandwich. Now it could go here, but it can't because the sandwich goes here and this one has to be bunny and we already used the bunny sandwich. So that must go up here. So we have rice here and sandwich there. And then let's see, we need a pig at the top and it can't go here because the middle is a uh, bunny egg and not pig rice. So it's gotta go here. So the pig rice will go here. Then we have a kitty at the bottom. Now the other bunny goes here and the other piggy goes here. So that means that the cat rice has to be here, the cat egg here, and the cat sandwich here. Hey, I did it! Hey, we did it! It was pretty cute. Thanks for helping awesome. out, Nancy. You're welcome. Could you tell me a little bit about the Ryokan? I'm not into that sort of thing. Couldn't you find a pamphlet? I was hoping for an insider's opinion. Oh, I get it. You want the dirt on the situation, right? Yes, exactly. Interesting. You're working some kind of anger here, aren't you? Not that it matters. Still, way too busy to talk. I know you're busy, but I helped you out with Bento, and all I want is a little information. Okay. Surrounded by breathtaking views you'll not soon forget, the Ryoka Hie opens the door to a simpler time. Perfect for the business traveler hoping to experience traditional Japan, or the family in search of that perfect vacation. Ryoka Hie, discover Japan, discover you. That's persuasive, but not exactly what I wanted to know. Isn't it? That's mine from years back. I was thinking of going into advertising, but then I thought, nah. I was hoping you could tell me a little about some of the strange things that have been happening. Aha! If you really want to know. Oh no! I'm running out of bento boxes! Can you please go grab my backup stock from my apartment? This is the sort of thing that can move us from buddies to straight up besties. Sure. Sure. Great! It's just over by the Kurume station. I could tell right away that we were going to be friends. Here's my key. <laughs> she just gives us the key to her apartment. Oh, and P.S. Oh, dear. My number is 075-021-5855. All right. Your grandmother seems a little hesitant to talk to me. That's the shocker of the decade. She's hesitant to talk to herself. What do you think of Rentaro? Other than that he should get a job at the nerd statue factory as their primary model? He's a good time. What do you think of Rentaro? He seems nice. He's a bit of a pest. Nice works if you want to be polite, but come on, this isn't the Ryokan. You can say what you mean. That is what I meant. Okay, if you say so. What does Takai think of you working here? It's a phase. Aro snap out of it. Like I've been hypnotized and one day someone says the right word and snaps their fingers and Aro go, Hero, I am Yumi. One job running Ryokan, please. She's old school like that. Thinks the fun parts of life are a phase, and the nasty parts are the bees and knees. I met your sister, Miwako. You two seem pretty close. That doesn't sound like the impression you'd get by having a chat with Miwako. What are you trying to ask? Miwako seemed a little upset about the Ryokan. Do you know anything about that? That's more her area of expertise. I've never been the go-to girl for the Ryoka. That place is the definition of repetitive. Guests come in, guests come out. It's brain-breakingly tedious. I don't know how Miwako puts up with it. Does Miwako like working at the Ryokan? What a yeah! Why else would she be there day in and day out? What that girl needs is to spend some time out here. 
A few weeks with me and my friends would be enough to shake her up and get her to have some fun for once. So you don't want to take over the Ryokan? Not even for a second. I mean, I don't even get the whole tradition thing. You want to go to the past? Get a time machine. I'm not one for living in the past. Have you ever read a history book? The past is where we keep all of the terrible things that have happened. I don't understand. If you're the one who's supposed to take over the Ryokan, why is Miwako the one working there? Ugh, Nancy-chan. Don't get all everyone else on me here. If I had known I was supposed to run that place when I grew up, I would have taken a pass on the whole firstborn thing. Trust me. If Miwako left the Ryokan, who would run it? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Why do you care so much about it anyway? I'm just sort of naturally curious. I'd back Burner that curiosity as long as you're staying at the Ryokan if I were you. What do you mean? Try not to find out, okay, Nancy? You seem nice. Well then. Nancy, do you have my boxes? Not yet. Please hurry! I need those boxes! Well, but we still wanted to talk more. Okay, well let's go try to find that Kurume station or whatever. Okay, so let's see. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay. So... We get back to Seto and get on the gray line, which should take us up to Kofu and down to the Gourmet Station. Okay, I think that should work. So, yeah. Alright, we got this. We can do this. We can figure this out. Oh wait, why can't... Oh, we gotta go up to Fuji first. Okay. Up to Fuji and then down. Like this way. And down here. Kofu, hopefully. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Perfect. And then... Kurume! Perfect! Alrighty. So now, I guess we just go into her apartment? Like, she just met us and she wants us to go into her apartment and grab her boxes for These her. These must be what Yumi was talking about. But of course, we're not just going to grab the box and leave. We have to look around a little bit. I mean, come on. Okay, let's see. There's a window. And a book. Savannah Woodham. That's the author of this book. I should hang on to this. Having her phone number might come in handy. And Savannah is the one who's in the... It uh, looks like someone tore out one of the hall. chapters. Someone tore out a chapter? Chapter 6, Ryokan here. Okay, so someone tore out that chapter. But yeah, Savannah Woodham was the one who called us in uh, for the Ghost of Thornton Hall. Okay. Kasumi was their mom, so that's from someone to their mom. Or, or no, from their mom to somebody. Okay. Of course, everything has passwords. Oh, a book on shadow puppets. Okay. How about this? And of course this has a password. Um, let's see, what else is there? There's gotta be something in this closet. I need to translate that. Let's translate it then. I need a dictionary oh. to translate that. I'm trying to grab the dictionary, Nancy. Okay, so let's just die. What's this? Ooh, a CD. Maybe we can put that in the computer? Let's go see if we can. All right, let's see what happens. Kind of nervous. That sounds weird. Oh yeah. Not her again. What was that? I don't know what that was. It was weird, is what that was. Okay. Well then, so there's that. Well, let's go uh, bring this stuff back to Yumi and tell her that we snooped in her house. Oh, Yumi. Nancy, and you've got my boxes. Neat. Here, I've got a thing for you. It's a phone charm. Oh, cool. You can't not have one. Mm -hmm. Thanks. What's it do? Come to think of it, it doesn't really do anything. 
Get a job, phone charm. <laughs> it probably won't. That's, That's okay, just hang it on your phone. I've got tons. Help me with bento, and I'll hook you up with some super cute ones. Your awesome. outfit is very interesting. Where did you get it? Get it? Oh, you cannot get something this cool in a store. I made it. You make your oh, own cool. clothes? Yeah, I got sick of waiting for the boutiques to catch up to me. The places I go around here, fashion is the business. You don't show up looking out of date. Oh, I've got the best thing. You gotta have it. I use it to come up with all of my new ideas. Oh, what's that? It's a program for your phone. You upload pictures to the computer and send them to your phone. It lets you test out a new look on you or your friends. It's back at my place on the computer. Sounds great. I don't usually have time to keep up with the latest fashion trends. I could sort of tell, but I wasn't sure if you were going for an irony thing with your outfit. Hey! Just teasing. You pull off the old school thing, Nancy Drew. Some things don't go out of style. If you help me out with a little more bento right now, I'll hook you up with the program. Come on. Okay, I guess we're doing more, ben more bento. Um, let's see. So, where should we start? Um... I guess we could start with maybe like the cat sandwich here and the pig egg here. Then we've got these three will be rice, but we don't know what pattern it goes in. Then if we had like say the cat egg here and the bear egg here, then we would have bear rice, cat rice, pig rice, then now we should need the sandwiches, which, oh that does, wait. Oh yeah, I guess that does work. We had this sandwich here and that sandwich Phew, here. Oh, it's we did it! Busy here today. Perfect. Great job. Here you go, Nancy. Cool. All right. Why do you have a book on shadow puppets? Oh, that's Miwako's. It shouldn't be in my apartment. It's just a stupid book about puppets. It's just another one of the things that my grandmother is trying to always push on us. Could you use something like this to make spooky shadows from far away? Say, a balcony? Yeah, I guess. Hmm, okay. I found Savannah's ghost book in your apartment. Can you tell me more about that? She's some sort of ghost hunter or something. I don't know much about it, okay? But she did a chapter on the Ryokan. Yeah, well, just because my grandmother believes in that junk doesn't mean I do. Okay. I really like your apartment. You do? Thanks! It's just a 1K. That's code around here for tiny and overpriced, but the location is great and it's mine. I love it. When did you move out of the Ryokan? The second I was old enough to sign a lease. Best decision I've ever made. No late night room service. No annoying tourists calling up at four in the morning. I adore that apartment. <laughs> That's funny. I wonder if it knows. I'm going to get it something nice today. A new doormat or something. I watched that DVD at your place. It was very strange. You did what? Shouldn't I have? Whoops. Oh no, I'm sorry, Yumi. I'm sure it'll be fine. Just be very cautious. What do you mean? You have to be cautious about everything here, Nancy. Can you tell me a little bit about what happened with your mother? This is not the time or the place. Is there a better time? Maybe when you're not at work? <sighs> There's never going to be a time or place. Just drop it. Okay then. Well. Alrighty. Unfortunately, that is all the time that we have for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like if you did like this video. And we'll see you next time. Bye!